Now, over 5,000 internally displaced victims of land grabbing, property demolition, and alleged forceful acquisition of properties in some 11 communities, Kwara State, have appealed to President Bola Tindabu to intervene in the matter to compel the Group Managing Director of the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation or Company Limited NNPCL, Melikari, to compensate them with 160 billion 750 million naira. The spokesperson of the affected victims, Tokbe Ajetumobi, who spoke at the press conference in Ilori, the state capital, said 976 structures were allegedly demolished by the Nigerian army engineers in favor of the NNPCL, rendering at least 5,000 victims homeless without compensation. According to Ajetumobi, a series of efforts have been made before now to secure compensation, but were blatantly frustrated by the managing director of the NNPCL. They are calling on the president to intervene urgently. In March 2018, a vast demolition and destruction of properties took place along the Okioji and Root Tanker Pipeline to Babaude, Elori, Kwara State, Nigeria, over a total distance of 11.83 kilometers with a width of 42.5 meters by the Nigerian Army Engineers in favor of the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation, now Nigerian National Petroleum Company Limited. It is on this note that these victims, as I represent them, is making a good demand for the people the sum of 160 billion 750 million naira. We are using this medium to inform and thereby informing, appealing, and calling the attention of our president and commander in chief of the armed forces, Nigeria President Bola Ahmed Tinubu, GCFR, in news purview, the his appointee, which happens to be Malamele Kiari and subject that he should from today give us a payment as I've been required for. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.